Hello everyone, we are constructing a square of length 6 cm. Let's make our sketch. We have E, F, G and H. 6 cm. All sides equal, of course, and we have 90 degree angles at each corner. So let us begin. We take our rule out and we draw a straight line as a baseline that is more than six centimeters long. We call one point E. Now take our compass out, we stretch out the arm of our compass, placing the point of the compass at point E. We stretch the arm of our compass out until we have 6 cm. We use a lighter pencil to make a construction arc as shown. This will give us point F. We now want to construct a 90 degree angle at point F. So we will move the point of our compass to point F. Stretch out the arm of the compass until it can cut the line. Using our lighter pencil, we make a construction arc. Swing the compass around, do not change the radius. Make another construction arc. Replace the point of our compass as shown here at this place of intersection stretch out the arm beyond point F but still able to cut the line and draw a construction arc above point F here move the point of the compass to this other point do not change the radius of the compass and draw another construction arc to intersect the previous one we now use our long ruler and our deeper pencil and we draw a line which passes through F and this newly formed point of intersection. We make sure the line is more than six centimeters long. We now take our compass out and place the point of the compass at point F. We ensure that the distance between the arms of the compass is 6 cm. We use our long ruler to measure this. We use our lighter pencil and make a construction arc as shown. This will give us point G if we follow the plan that we have in our sketch up here. We now Move the point of the compass to point E without changing the radius of the compass because we want to construct a parallel line to EF that will pass through G. We use our lighter pencil to draw a construction arc as shown. We now move the point of the compass to point G And draw a construction arc to intersect the previous one. This point that is formed, this point H, we now use our long ruler and connect points G to H and then we connect points H and E, a straight line. And that will give us our square. We can verify the lengths of the square using our ruler to ensure that all the lengths are 6 centimeters long. We can also use our protractors to ensure that the angles at the vertices 
the interior angles at all 90 degrees. So, so far, it looks like we are just about accurate. Thanks for watching and all the best to you in your studies.